Welcome back to the channel. Today we are doing a realistic hunt for some whitetail and way of the hunter. If you are new here, make sure you hit that like button, comment down below, don't forget to subscribe. I really do appreciate it. Without further ado, we're going to go get us some whitetail on this little feed zone right up here. Well, they just snorted at me. So I'm pretty sure that's whitetail. I don't know if mule deer snort like that. But um, I don't know what whitetail this is. It might be this one, or it could be a whole new one that I haven't discovered yet. So what we're going to do is pin up on a tree here and try to bag one of these guys in. And uh, hopefully get a good a good uh, whitetail here. A nice buck. I don't know how these bags are going to work. I haven't tried them yet, so uh, we'll see. It doesn't even sound like anything like a actual uh, antlers rattling, but whatever. Maybe that's just the way they sound. I don't have a uh, attraction range either, so I might be way out of range. Sounds like they're up over that hill there, but again, the sounds could bounce, so I'm not sure exactly. Uh, wind is not in our favor. Looks like it is going that direction, so we'll see how this goes. I'm going to sit here and call for a minute. If nothing comes up in like 10 minutes, I'm going to go moving forward and see what we can find. All right, the more I listen to this call, the more it sounds like a mule deer. But uh, I, I do want to get visual confirmation. I like to see, I actually like to see what the deer is. So Sometimes the calls are iffy on me. I play with my mind. That is way late to not pay attention. But I can't tell with the females. It still sounds like a mule deer. That's a mule deer, isn't it? I wish I could remember exactly how they sound. But I always forget when I move on to the next one. I just forget the old one. <laughs> I still want to get some visuals here. By the way, I have been keeping an eye on our melanistic mule deer. I did see him again. Uh, he's not very big yet, so I'm going to wait it out a little longer before we try to hunt him down. But he still say, seems to be in that same location, around that same location. He was slightly different. Uh, but hopefully we can find him when we actually want to go hunt him. Probably give it a, I don't know, a couple more days. Let's see if he's matured anymore. Problem with melanistic is I can't tell how old he is. Because he has no color, right? And he's pure black. He's no... He doesn't turn gray, I don't think. Oh. They are so close. Not in a good spot. At all. So close. It's mule deer. Oh, he's not bad either. Well, okay, we have two tags to date. He should be dead. I don't know, because I don't know the trajectory of... of these arrows. Oh, yeah. He is absolutely dead. Holy smokes. Smoked him. All right. Um, we are going to go get another white, uh, actual white tail today, though. So uh, I'm going to go grab this guy. He shouldn't be very far. He just went down right there. That is crazy. All right. Wow. I cannot believe we got that close. That bag was great, apparently. Because he was coming right to me. Wow. Alright. 
I'll take it. Uh, not what we were after, but I will take it. And we will go get a, a white tail here shortly. We're going to head up to that zone still. But it does make me wonder, there should be another zone around here then for uh, the mule deer, because I don't know where those mule deer's locations were. Because I don't have any around here. I don't think this guy is crazy big. I think he might be a three-star, possibly creeping up on a four-star. Uh, I don't know, though. Nah, I don't think he's going to be a three. He might be a three. Well, that's cool. I like how they show the arrow. That's nice. Wow, that's a good shot. Nice. That's close to the heart there, but... What do you guys think? Three or four? I'm going to go with a three. Oh, he's a two. Okay. It's pretty wide. Yeah, he's missing that, that point there. That would have made a four star, probably. That one right there would have probably made a four star. What in the world did they add up here? I don't I don't like that. I don't, I don't like that at all. I want the solid black like it was before. Yeah, I'm not a fan of that. Why did they, why did they do that? Because I can't, it's harder to edit out the background when you have stuff in the background. So it makes way more sense to have just a black background, but I'm not a game developer, so whatever. <laughs> anyway, let's go get a, a white tail. Hopefully we can find one. I like to, I'd like to find one when they're feeding and try to call one in for us, but I don't know. We'll see how that goes. Well, I made it to their spot. I think, um, I think their feed zone is like right down in here somewhere. I don't see anything around right now. I didn't spook anything either because I didn't hear any sounds, but we're going to stay here for a minute and, well, actually a while because it's only 320. And I'm hoping they don't come up this way. I'm hoping they come up from like over here. I don't know where the rest zone is, so they could be anywhere. You know, they could be coming over here, over here, or even down here, and I might spook them with my wind, but... Uh, we'll see. I'm just going to sit here for a bit. And hopefully one comes in. And we can rattle them in. Or grunt call them in. I have both of those with me. So we'll, uh, we'll see how it goes. I'm hoping, I'm hoping a good giant five-star perfect score whitetail shows up. Maybe an albino or a melanistic. Either one, either one. You know, we'll see. But uh, I'll be back with you guys when we get some kind of action. All right. I don't know where they're at. But I did just hear a white tail give a big old snort. I don't know where it came from, though. Was that one? That one sounded weird. I don't know where it's coming from. I've been sitting here for a while. It is... Pretty close to five. The wind is not really that great, but... I think we'll be all right. I'm hoping I can see something here, but they might be... down in that little crevice there where I can't see. So it might be a patience game here. I might have to wait it out and see if I can see one. So far, I'm not seeing anything. The snort came from pretty far away. At least it sounded like it, but maybe it's pretty close. I don't know. Just gonna stay here for a little longer and uh, maybe we can get some action here. I'm not not seeing anything yet though. But I at least know they're here. Somewhere. Don't really know where. Nice if they crested that hill right there, but Unlikely. 
course, I have to get one in somehow. So that's going to be fun. So I'm going to work my way to the right here and try to call one up to the right. I think we've hunted this spot before. And I think last time I went to the right, they ended up being over here and I had to come back. But right now, I think they are right around there. At least that's where I saw them. So they could be further down the hill, but I'm going to come over this way, sit behind a tree, and try to call one in. I'd call one in this side, but they'd see me pretty easily, so I kind of want to get higher to the right or left of them and get behind a tree or get inside a tree and take one out that way. Hopefully they can call one in, but we'll see. I'll work my way over there. Might take me a second. Um... I didn't really see any big ones, though, so I'm not sure if there's one in there. If not, we might take a doe, which is not very interesting, but um, if there's a decent one, we'll take it out. But I don't know if it's going to be uh, happening this episode. I'm a little rusty. I've been uh, been gone for three weeks, so i got to get back into the swing of things here. So bear with me as we start our realistic hunts again, which there'll be two this week, one on Monday and one on Friday. Um, and I think Friday we might take our out our melanistic mill deer, so stick around and make sure you watch that video on Friday. By the way, guys, I do... Greatly appreciate all the support you guys have uh, given. We have gotten over 520 subscribers now, which is fantastic. I really, really, really do appreciate it. And I hope we can continue to grow and reach that 1,000 thousand subscriber mark. We're halfway there, over halfway there. So hopefully we can get get there by the end of the year. And like maybe by June would be great, but uh, we'll see. I don't expect it to happen that fast. That'd be crazy. Slow and steady, though. We're slowly on the rise. And it's all because of you guys. And it's, uh, I really do appreciate it. Alright, I'm gonna get to a tree up here and, uh, we'll try to call one in. There's not really much, uh, in terms of options for trees up here. So, I'm gonna sit in one of these bushes. And, uh, Try to start calling one in here with the bag. Hopefully we can get some in here. Uh, if they come in down this hill right here, we're in trouble because uh, I can't see them. <laughs> so I'm hoping they come up uh, kind of this direction and then to me that way, but we'll see. Maybe they won't even come at all. I saw them briefly, and they might be gone, so I, I don't know. We'll see. I sit here for a bit. I'll try to rattle one in. Well, there they are. I see them They're right there in front of me behind that tree. So that's good. They're still here. Question is, are there any good ones? Eh, not really. <laughs> I think he's the biggest of the group, which is not saying much. It's pretty bad, isn't it? All right, uh, well, we got one coming in towards us. I don't know what he is. It's got to be a high fitness, though. It's right there in front of me. Actually, they're all kind of coming this way. Gotta get him within bow range, so they gotta be pretty close. <laughs> Unless I wanna try some kind of crazy arc shot with a crossbow. 
I hope they had uh, actual draw bows. I'd like to shoot one of those. And hopefully they add in like tree stands and stuff. That'd be awesome. We can set up into a tree. Oh, be great for bow hunting. I'm hoping that one's still coming this way. But I can't see anything because this this little drop in the hill here. But uh, he might be gone too. He might be in that pack. I don't know. Nope. He's coming to me. I can get one more rattle in. That'd be nice. He's right there in front of me. Oh, he's decent. He's decent. I'll go ahead and get one more rattle in. Well, the crossbow here. He's coming right at me with a, cro uh, a direct heart shot here. How is that not a heart shot? Man, I thought that was a heart shot. Anyway, <laughs> we caught him at least. I really thought that was going to be a heart shot. That looked pretty, pretty spot on. Now, I was told by a co-worker at work that watched one of my videos. He uh, said, uh, the time you eat an apple is the time to... Uh, for them to die, so. Hmm. If it's a good shot, obviously. And I don't think that was a good shot, apparently. I don't think I even hit a lung. Yikes. Man, I thought that was a hard shot. I guess I was either just slightly off, too high, or too low. Uh, interesting. Oh, well, it's what it is what it is. We will try to find him. Uh, it's going to be a minute because uh, I've already lost the blood trail. So I'm going to have to go back to where I shot him and find him that way, which he ran right through here, didn't he? I thought I would have seen the blood. But I shot him from that bush, and he was like right here. Okay, so he went this way. He might not die for a while. <laughs> ah, that sucks. I thought that was a good shot. Maybe it wasn't. Clearly it wasn't, I guess. Uh, okay, so he turned here a little bit. Anyway, I'm going to track this guy down now. i uh, see you guys when I find him. Hopefully not an hour from here. All right, well, uh, it must have been a decent shot. Probably an artery, is my guess. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and say he is a two-star. I don't think he's that big. Yeah, we got an artery. Artery is what did it. We did hit a left lung, though, so that's decent. Uh, okay, so I needed to aim a little lower. Oh, wow, we got that big artery, too. Yeah. That's definitely what killed him. Left lung added to it, but... Definitely the artery. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and say he's a two-star. Oh, he's a one. Wow. Okay, even worse. It's not a big day for hunting. Uh... I've been a l I'm a little rusty, so I'm going to have to uh, get back into the swing of it. Hopefully, uh, next next realistic hump, we can get that melanistic, and hopefully he's grown pretty big. But anyway, that's going to be it for this episode, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure to hit that like button. Comment down below. Don't forget to subscribe. I really do appreciate it. I am glad to be home, and I will continue to put out videos for you guys. I'll catch you guys in the next episode. Hope you guys have a fantastic day. OCGI.